the bell to start the round. Lands with that right uppercut. Off the charts action from both of these fighters. You couldn't write a script like this. This is like Rocky versus Apollo. Well, there's no business like show business, and this is the most unique play anyone will ever see in this theater, mano a mano. You walk in, you cannot hide or duck or stand behind anybody. The audience is on you. They see every single movement, every single twitch. If you're scared, the thousands of people are here in this place. They will spot it. Back and forth they go in this round. The momentum continues to shift. Perfectly matched. Skill for skill. Tap for tap. Now this fight will say, you know what, I'm just that notch above you. And so I've got to respect both of them. More than happy. Caution being thrown to the wind. Catch and shoot. Swing and a miss with the hook. That left hook missed. You know the scorecards are going to be all over the place. And stumbling around in potholes. That was almost a... They ring the bell and here we go. Well, Johnny, can he keep the momentum going after that last... Oh my! That's a game changer! And down goes the giant! How about that technique on that headshot? Let's see it again and appreciate it more. A shot from the dogs took him out! At some point, the corner may have to intervene here because this fighter won't stay down. Get up, look at this corner. Look at the instructions. They're telling him to calm down. Make the most of the count. Get up, breathe, and move. Get behind the referee. Save yourself a bit of time. You just need to make your way back to the corner. Somehow, get to the end of the round. Sometimes when you're fighting a counterfighter, the rounds can get a little boring. You get trigger shy because you know if you throw a punch, one is coming right back at you. Reaction is second to none. It's the blink of an eye, and they're waiting for any little twitch you do. So you've got to fight a counter punch you're smart. Halfway through the round, and I think he knows he's got a lot of work to do. It's that for Everholt. Remember the fight at Evander Holyfield? He could be behind on points until the last. Why weren't they covering up? for a second of getting out of trouble, but now he's right back in the phone booth. Got caught sleeping on the job. What do you do? Step back, steady yourself, recompose yourself, then boom, back into it. But do not make those mistakes. This is the wrong place to play this one. One final 10 seconds here, and I think he knows who's won this round. It's not over till it's over. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. He couldn't finish him off in the last round. Let's see what this has in store for us. Todd, listen to me. If I knock somebody down like that, that round, you know this round coming out? He's getting everything, everything full battle because I know his legs are gone. So this, you watch what's going to happen. If he doesn't, I'll be very, very surprised. <laughs> No rest for the weary. <laughs> the 
this fighter's always on their toes, trying to get their opponent rattled, get them off kilter, get them out of their rhythm. If you want to corner an outside fire, make them fight off the rope because they don't want to do that. They don't want to stand still. They want to move left to right. Put them down. Throw a blanket on them. Halfway through the round, and man, these two are going at it. When are we going to see a jab from these two? Skill for skill, tap for tap. She's like a match made in heaven. That hook won't score. No rest for the weary. <laughs> So much firepower here. All right, write it out. Don't worry about it. One shot. Don't give another one. Okay. Straight right just misses. Beautiful counter shot. Despite what the judges' scorecards read, there are no losers in this one. All three judges here are going to give that. And there's the bell to start the round. Well, there's no doubt about who won that last round. Let's see what he has for us here in the next one. Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round. Everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep a chance to make history. So far, so far, it's been a tough, tough round. What do you do? What do I tell him when he got the pump? Stumbling around the Bambi legs. And Kingmaker has been knocked down. As we take another look, you can see it. The body shot was pitch perfect. Point. There's no doubt who's won this round so far. Well, they're back up now, but they've got to be cautious. Cannot afford to trade back now, can they, Johnny? The corner needs to think nice and sharp. They know they fight. They know their fight is taking. We're always looking for that KO, and we could see an upset right here. Just one punch away from getting the momentum back. Defense, defense, defense is everything because they got shot once and know they can get caught again. So for now, just defense, work on defense, blocking and stopping and shooting. If you'd like to see more jabs. We exchange punches. We enter the final 10 seconds here in a pretty dominant display. What a huge momentum. They ring the bell and here we go. Got to get the momentum shift coming their way. What can they do here? That knockdown we just saw was a heavy knockdown. I'd be very, very surprised if he'll come out Flash it, it. That's not gonna happen. He's got a hustle now. He's got a he's got a bluff. When you're fighting a massive heavyweight like this, you can't go toe to toe. You gotta stick and move and use angles. If you're in there with a guy so big in front of you, you've got to be smart. You've got to use your smarts and use that skill. This is what you've prepared for. You've got to negate that jab, let it ride past you, and push his own weight on him. They've got to use their jab better in this fight. A perfect counter shot. Back and forth they go. Cannot throw out a lazy jab in this fight. You'll get knocked out.
decision. There's nothing quite like a heavyweight fight. It doesn't take much to win it. That counter punch caught him clean. Which one of these athletes is going to say, I can't take it anymore? Very competitive round with 10 seconds left. And it's no secret who has the advantage after that lap. We're hoping for an all action slug fest. They've got all the momentum on their side after that last round. Let's see what they do here. Todd, my motto is if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last run, everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. They both want the knockout. Good counter punching. What do you think of what we've seen so far from these two boxers, Johnny? Some fighters are just gifted. Gifted with such hand speed, footwork, movement. They are gifted. They are the chosen few. And now going for the finish. <laughs> Looks like trouble was averted. What recovery skills they are. What a shot it was. Completely gone. I thought there's no way he's going to finish this round. But look at that. Look at the movement. Look at the speed. Back on it. Like it never happened. This has been a very competitive round as we reach the midway point. Very close match. It shows the skill, the discipline, the respect both fighters have for each other. Because no one dare do anything out of turn. Nice counter punch right up the middle. They're both trying for a knockout. They have no respect for each other's punching power. Very close round with 10 seconds to go. The count. They've got the momentum, they've got the advantage. We're hoping for an all action slug fest. Last round complete domination. Let's see what we have in store for us here. Todd, my motto is if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round, everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. Straight right, just missing. This is a heavyweight division. One punch could end this fight. Work the body, frustrate them, take the mind off the chin, take the mind to protect everything around that. Work the body, use tactics. Sometimes it's so hard to actually outbox a fight and beat them on points. Caution is being thrown to the wind. This has been a very competitive round between these two. They're so close, so close. How can you separate them? It's going to be a hard night tonight for the judges. Gotta let your hands go a little bit. It's okay to be aggressive now. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there might be more action here. So he's going to taunt here. I don't know if that's the wisest strategy. The building is going bananas. Will they see a huge upset here? the advantage so far and there's the bell to start the round 
Coming off that fantastic last round. Let's see if he can keep his momentum going. Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round. Everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. There's no way this fighter can go punch for punch. Their resistance to these blows just isn't the same. This is when you get in the ring feeling like you're King Kong because you know you've got a chin that is not going to get dented. Both men step back for just a moment. That uppercut misses. Tough to be a judge in this fight as both fighters have had their big moments. Misses with the jab. Very close match. It shows the skill, the discipline, the respect both fighters have for each other because no one dare do anything out of turn. How nervous would you get when you know you're facing a big puncher like this that can seriously hurt you? It's the one who draws first blood, Todd. That's what you've got to look at. If you've hit and you know you're in there with a banger, you've got to be on it, but you've got to be confident. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there would be uh, some more action here. This round's still up for grabs with just 10 seconds to go. time they throw a shot they get countered that was almost a 10-8 round they ring the bell and here we go that last round was huge for him johnny how does he keep the momentum going todd my motto is if it's not broken why change it an excellent last round everything works wait for the reaction until then keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down Needs to put some combination work together. One punch is good, two punches better. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there might be more action here. The work rate is down. The head isn't moving as well, Johnny. Fatigue is starting to set in. What can they change? Can they slow the pace down? Can they hope to, to, to knock them out early? What can they do? They've got to concentrate and relax. Because you know what you can do in the gym. You can do it in a fight. They've got to relax. Halfway through the round, and there's not a lot separating these two. Skill for skill, tap for tap. She's like a match made in heaven. Got to let your hands go a little bit. It's okay to be aggressive now. Both men step back for just a moment. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there might be more action here. This round could go either way. Ten seconds to go. Pretty dominant round there. Let's see how they respond. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. That round was complete domination. Let's see if we can shake things up here in this round. Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round. Everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. In the build-up to this fight, Johnny, this power puncher told us, listen, I don't care if it's round one or round 12, I've got enough power and confidence to end this in one shot. This could be really intimidating, Todd. If you know somebody's got the punch power, someone's got the speed, it can be intimidating. Just depends on how confident you are as a fighter.
cannot throw out a lazy jab in this fight. You'll get knocked out. What a round so far as we've reached the halfway point. When are we going to see a jab from these two? Perfectly matched. Skill for skill. Tap for tap. Now, this fight will say, you know what, I'm just that notch above you. And so I've got to respect both of them more than happy. This is a high-octane battle. I guess showboating is part of their plan. By the way, the connect percentages have to be off the charts. Despite what the judges' scorecards read, there are no losers in this one. No surprise as we get a unanimous decision there. They've done it before, now they're doing it again, and look what's happened. A unanimous decision.